Hey boys, welcome back to Season 2 of the Roosters Career Mode. So obviously, starting the season off with uh, Auckland Nines, and we got a few um, a few signings, obviously. Lisa Armel, uh Penny Terrapo there, uh, Paulie Paulie. So we uh, we stocked up on the on the forwards, the, uh, the f I guess they're, they're front rollers. They're, they're mainly front rollers. Paulie Paulie plays out, out wide a bit. A bit. I guess. Uh, who else did we get? We got Cody Nikarima. And uh, for the nines, for the tournament, I decided to put Cody Nikarima at fullback. Now, uh, Latrell Mitchell's still on the side, but I was sort of thinking about maybe just having Cody Nikarima play fullback. So what do you, what do you guys think about that? For the for the rest of the nines tournament, Nikarima is going to be the, the fullback. As we look at the Rabbitohs, they're... Uh, they're a tough side on the game, not doing too well in real life, but they're, they're very strong on the game. Their big signing there looks like Tim Simona. Um, I actually, I tried to sign Simona, uh, Simona uh, when the recruiting opened, but he, uh, he decided to go to the Rabbitohs, which I was pretty disappointed about. Uh, but yeah, so what do you guys reckon? Put Cody Nick Remo at fullback or put, uh, put Mitchell back there? It's a beautiful offload. That is uh, great stuff there. Get it out wide to Nikarima, Jaden Nikarima. He's going to score a, uh, a nice try. But the reason I, I <laughs> the reason I wanted to put Nikarima at fullback is because he's like 80, 83, 84 rated. He's good on the game, and Latrell Mitchell unfortunately is uh, is not rated well on the game, which is understandable. I mean, I could change the stats, but I honestly I'm not too sure how to change the stats, and it's a, it's a lot of mucking around, and I can't really be bothered. So. I don't know, I might, when the season starts off, I might think uh, it would be better to have Nick Arima coming off, off the bench as like a backup dummy half, because you, you always need a backup dummy half, and having a, having a good one on the bench uh, like Nick Arima would be, would be good, but um, we'll see as uh, Hargrave's there. What a nice uh, barge over, and then the beautiful little pass back to Pierce. I can't believe we didn't score, but it was, uh, it was nice stuff. But uh, yeah, that's the that's a little dilemma. The rest of the team is going to be pretty standard, I would say. Obviously, a few of the forwards would change, but great English here. This is what you know. Playing the Rabbitohs in the nines is a uh, pretty tough because someone like an English just so much room to move. Nikarima couldn't quite catch up, and uh, well, <laughs> Cody Nikarima couldn't quite catch up, and then no, no fucking Jaden Nikarima couldn't catch up, and then Cody. Uh, just got shrugged out of the way. Jesus, I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna get mixed up, deluxe with those two, aren't I? But um, look to hit back pretty pretty quickly. Hargraves tries to take, tries to just barge out of the way of English, but English just manhandling manhandles him, and a uh, nice long pass there. Uh, very poor defense by the Rabbitohs. They actually had the numbers there, but uh, looks like who was that? John Sun, I think. It looks like Sun. He raced up out of the line and got nothing. Didn't get the ball, didn't get the man. And a uh, nice simple try as uh, we have Cody Nikarima kicking. I don't I don't really know why. Um, he, I think he was just the default kicker, so I didn't bother changing it. I'm not too sure who to put as a goal kicker. You know, obviously for the Roosters, uh, Hastings, Hastings has been doing... He's starting to do most of the kicking now, but Takeahu does a fair bit. Um, I know Mitchell has done a bit of kicking. But, um, I don't know. I might just put it as one of the Nicarima boys. I'm sure they've they've kicked before. <laughs> as we, we are 10-6 up just before half-time as Pierce throws the dummy, goes around there. Ferguson, though, gets tackled. I, I didn't want to pass it out to him. I wanted him to go to the center, but it's, uh, it's a decent half-time half scoreline. You know, getting, getting back into the rhythm of the Roosters. Haven't played with the Roosters side in a, in a fair while. Obviously, the uh, playing as Tonga. And just uh, in general, been playing other other series and haven't uh, hopped on the Roosters in a while. But it's uh, it's good to be back. I uh, I'm I'm not the you know the Roosters aren't my favourite team, but I, I don't mind their side. And uh, they're pretty fun to play, pretty fun to play as they got a lot of good outside backs and a uh, decent forward pack. And obviously with the signings, they've got a a very good forward pack. I think the forward pack is uh, is pretty pretty good. You know it means like. Probably guys like Sam Moa and Kane Evans probably won't get a get on the bench. It's right there. We get picked up for a forward pass. I was pretty annoyed about that one. I didn't think it was forward, but you know, guys like Kane Evans, 
uh, Sam Moa probably uh, probably get uh, you know shafted a little bit with the signings, but uh, you know I prefer the guys we signed as Ferguson tries to get away there is going to break through. I thought he's going to get rounded up, but uh, the big uh, the big palm off into the chest of might be Alex Johnston out there. It was, uh, it was good work here by the player inside who gave the pass to Ferguson. He drew in like two players and uh, Ferguson, nice simple run of the try line, although he did have to have to get through of a, a tackler right there as uh, Nick Arima misses another goal. 14-6 to six, had a bit of a shocker with the boot. As uh, almost last play here. Looking to <laughs> do something with it. Throws a long ball. What about that one? Uh, he goes dropped. I don't know what's going on. Tubo just fucking dropped it cold. Uh, it wasn't called a knock on, but we're still going here. A few seconds left in the game. I actually don't know what happened with Tubo. He completely dropped the ball, but it wasn't called a knock on. It was a little strange. As we throw the offload there, and uh, Tim Simona is going to pick it up. That man I was talking about at the start. You know, as last play of the game, we were just uh, throwing everything at them. And Tim Simona scores. His first try in uh, Rabideau's colours. And like I said, I wanted to sign Simona. Uh, he's one of my favourite players. Uh, but he turned us down. <laughs> he turned us down, unfortunately. Even though we probably didn't need a, uh, another outside back. I would have fit him in the side. I probably would have just dropped fucking, I don't know, Ferguson or someone like that. But uh, that's a decent first up win. 14-12. to 12, A little tight at the end. But hopefully you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you next time.